Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm coming back at you guys looking crusty and dusty, but that's okay because as you've seen by the title of this video, we're about to do something to this hair. So I'm not gonna stay like this, I promise. I ran across a video the other day. Um, I think her name is Farah. I don't know how to say her last name, but I will insert her clip on what I saw. Hi, hi, it's Farah, your local internet auntie, and today I'm gonna share my secret to shiny hair. I get asked on every single video how I get my hair so shiny, and this is my secret. But first, let's brew a cup of coffee. Brewed coffee is the secret. I have been using this since 2014, so you wanna make a really strong cup of coffee or two depending on how long your hair is and let it cool completely before you use it. Then you're gonna wash your hair with shampoo first. Let's just do a little bit of magic right here. Boom, washing the hair. Then you're just gonna rinse out the shampoo. Uh, you can condition if you want afterwards, um, but you wanna use coffee as the last step. You're gonna pour the coffee all over your hair and massage it into your scalp and wrap it up for 15 minutes and then wash it out. You don't need to shampoo it out. Coffee helps to lay your cuticle flat, which makes your hair very, very shiny. It prevents frizz and the caffeine prevents balding and hair loss. It also helps your hair grow because it stimulates the hair follicle. So that's my secret. Once I washed that, I was like, you know what? I want to see how that works out. I feel like my hair could use a little bit of shine and rejuvenation going on. I've seen that coffee does have some benefits on skin, but I've never seen or heard anything about coffee benefits on hair. So we're going to try that theory out today. Um, I know she has a different hair texture, so I want to see if that'll play into the equation, you know. I'm actually about to go wash my hair really quick. So I can already have that ready to go. My coffee is already brewed and it's cooling at this moment. I think I did about four cups, but we're gonna double check. And once my hair is all nice and washed, then I'll come back, okay? So hold tight. Okay, so as you see, I'm back, I'm out the shower. Hair is nice and washed and conditioned. I have my coffee. This is, yeah, I was right. This is about four, four cups. Um, I might have a bit much, but oh well. So yeah, I have my coffee, I have my bowl. As you saw what she did in the video, it looked like she kind of put her head over it and then poured it and then let her hair sit in it for a second. So that's what I'm gonna do. Um, I might do this over the tub. I don't think I'll be able to show that, but we gonna see. gonna try to see if I can get all of this in a shot. Um, let me make it easy for myself. So I'm gonna go ahead and okay, am I in the shot? Hopefully I'm in the shot. If not, I'm sorry. <laughs> Alright, let's do this. One more. Yep, I'm in here. Let me go grab one more shower cap. 
Okay, so we got this going. It says, she said to do it for 15 minutes. So during that time, I'm gonna make myself a little face mask because I'm having a breakout. It's almost that time. Let's rejuvenate. I actually saw a recipe for the clay and coffee mask. I already got coffee, so we're gonna do it. This whole bathroom smells like coffee. masked up my hair is wrapped I'm gonna set my timer for 15 minutes and I'll be right back all right guys so my 15 minutes is up as you see my mask is dry I'm over here giving you Shrek's auntie vibes how is that I'm gonna wash this off and <coughs> they ask you how you are you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine but you just can't get into it because they would never understand I'm gonna wash this off and I'll be right back. Okay. Okay, hold on, wait. Oh, side note, this is very messy when you put this on. So make sure that whatever you cover your hair in, that it's like tight and secure because I had to keep this on because it kept dripping. Side note. I'll be right back. Okay. I'm out. First impressions. Do I notice any immediate difference? Not really. Other than the fact that I smell like fresh brewed coffee. But, um, I don't really notice anything other than that. But that's just fresh out, you know? I can see what's my style and everything. But y'all know me. Or if you don't, now you know. I don't typically wash my hair and not add some type of conditioner or something afterwards. So. I'm going to try to let it dry a little bit before I add anything to see if maybe, I don't know. Like I said, she got a different hair texture than I do. But off rip, nah. What's the difference? I'll be back. We'll see. All right. So I am back. This is what my hair is looking like. Let me get close up. um it's not bad it's actually super soft um i will say that it is a tad bit shinier than what it typically is during my normal wash routine so ah uh, not bad will i incorporate this into my normal hair routine probably not however i want to try it again next time i straighten my hair because like i said before she has a different hair texture than i do but also her hair was straight so maybe i'll see more more of a difference if my hair was straight versus curly but i don't know we'll see one out of ten i'll give this maybe like a three i do like the smell of coffee so i might bump that up to a four um my hair doesn't it actually doesn't smell like coffee right now like barely but not really but yeah you, you guys should give it a try let me know what you think um I might try this again. Go ahead and comment down below a few more things you want me to try, you want to see me try, what I should review, because I'm open to it. I'm all for trying new things on my hair, especially if it's to boost it or make it stronger, or make it shiny, or to help shedding. I am still going through postpartum shedding. I'm not sure when it'll stop. I don't know if it's because this time I had a son, but I'm shedding a lot more with him postpartum versus my two daughters so yes the hair the hair oil that i make and all that stuff it does help but regardless it's hormonal it's still i'm still going through postpartum shedding i hope you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to like comment and share don't forget to subscribe so you can be a part of the family if you're new here welcome go ahead and turn on those post notifications so you can get notified the next time i drop another video I hope you guys have a blessed day. See you next time.